Welcome back YouTube, I have Ahmed again from In-Depth Tech Reviews and in today's video I'm going to introduce you to a very helpful piece of software that can recover all your lost or deleted files from your Windows PC, your Mac or even your external storage devices. The tool I have here is called Recover It and it's from a company called Wondershare and if you don't know Wondershare they are the people who created the well-known video editing software called Filmora that I personally use and the very popular tool called Dr. Phone that help you manage your mobile phones, data, and more. So I have to say they are doing really well in the software and in this video I'm gonna give you a complete walkthrough for the recovery tool telling you the main features, how to get it set up and to show you a real life scenario. But before getting started let's make sure you subscribe and hit the bell icon to get notified every time I post a new video. So let's jump in. So before showing you a hands-on experience, let's see the operating systems supported by Recoverit. As per the official website, it works with Windows starting from XP to Windows 10, and it also works with Mac OS starting from 10.9 up to 10.15 Catalina, which covers almost every Windows and the Mac OS user out there. So if you lost any of your valuable data due to a system update, deleted your files accidentally, or any other reason, Recoverit can allow you to recover your files files, your trash, formatted data, partition, and it works with all types of storage devices. It also works pretty much with all files including documents, graphics, video and audio files, emails, and more. So to get it on your device and start recovering your data, please click the link below in the description and the process is very simple. Just hit download, give it few minutes to finish downloading, open the file, hit install, Give it some time to finish, then click on Start Now. Keep in mind that Recoverit has a free version that can allow you to recover up to 100 megabytes, which is good enough for trying it yourself before paying for the full version. And I will talk about the prices later in this video. But now let me show you how to recover your lost data. So as you see, you have more than one option here. You can select the whole partition, either internal or external, or you can choose specific locations like your recycle pin, desktop, and a folder and the final option is to recover from your crashed computer. So if you want to know more about each one there is a user guide on the website that gives you step-by-step -step instructions either for Windows or Mac also the link will be in the description. And to make it simple I have here a folder that contains three songs, a video, a word document, an image and a PowerPoint presentation so I'm gonna delete all of them permanently using shift delete on Windows and then I will get back to recovery and click on select a folder and I will choose the same folder I showed you earlier and start the process so let's keep recovery do its magic and give you a quick look at the prices and you have here more than one option either a one month subscription if you think you will use it only once a one year subscription and finally the lifetime license so if you want to purchase recover it and check all of its features please check the link in the description so let's go back to recover it and it's done with the scanning phase and now you can see it shows the files I just deleted from the folder so I will select all of them and hit recover and it will ask me to choose a folder to recover my data in. Now there is one important thing you need to keep in mind it's recommended to choose a totally different drive to recover your data because that will improve the chances of getting your data back. So I'm gonna choose my D drive and I created a folder for this purpose to recover my data so I'm gonna select it and hit recover. And here you go, those are all the files I permanently deleted from my C drive. So that's pretty much it for today. I hope you like my video and if you do, please hit the thumbs up and subscribe for more videos. Thank you for watching.